This I wanna nail sports to the one Top blog out of the YouTube channel No matter which sports here we got it covered Subscribe and hit the notification bell Hey what's up sports to the bone family What's up what's up how are you guys doing Alright we have some information here Some cricket information Good news good news good news So as we know Ireland They are actually here in Jamaica at Sab Well they are preparing to take on West Indies at Sabina Park and you know the Jamaica Scorpions they played them in a little warm up game a little practice game and you know the Jamaica Scorpions was captained by uh by Ravman Powell yeah man and Powell led from the front to help stun the Irish so I'm just gonna read this little bit of information here for you guys so it says a captain's knock by Ravman Powell led Jamaica Scorpions to a spectacular win over the touring Ireland team at Sabina Park on Wednesday right they said a powerful right hander made 82 not out of 63 balls as Jamaica motored to victory yeah man we're talking about a target of uh, 235 for 5 of 38.5 overs yeah man this was after Ireland were bowled out for 234 of 48.5 overs so Ravman Powell, Ravman Powell did his thing as we, we were talking on the live the other night and we were saying that Ravman Powell is currently playing his cricket as a specialist batsman these days you know we, I can't tell when last I see Ravman Powell carry over his hand and, and do a little bit of bowling so he was actually the man that played and, and a, a very good knock there to help lead the team so as I said um you know 235 for five is where we finished ireland earlier made 234 all out yeah man uh powell smashed they are saying that powell sm smashed the ball to all over the place all over the historic venue right his half century came of 48 balls you know so he brought up the half century of 48 balls which included a couple of fours and five sixes so five sixes and two fours you know, he, he, he really did them dirty, my viewers and subscribers. They, they said that um, a crucial partnership was built between Powell and um, Paul Palmer. Yeah, man, Paul Palmer made 33 or uh, 40, you know, and that is what really helped us on. You know, uh, yeah, man, they, they took the score to 107 for 4. Yeah, man, um, in, in the 21st, oh, well, the, the score was 107 for 4 and they took it to 201 for 5. Yeah, so Paul Palmer and um, Ravman Powell there doing the business for us. That is a bit of good news, my viewers and subscribers. A bit of good news, you know, um, for for us. All right, so let me just let me just go through the scorecard um, quickly. So as I said, Ravman Powell he top scored with 82 not out. That is in my viewers and subscribers. 82 not out of 63 deliveries. So he got 82 of 63. Paul Palmer got 33 of 40. Uh, Brandon King chipped in well. He got 36 of 35. You know, um, Log got 16 of 29. So those are the players that stood out for us. Uh, for, for Ireland with the bowling, I am seeing here where Little, JB Little, he took three wickets for 21 runs. So he was a pick of the bowler. Yeah, bowlers. So that is basically how our runs um, came with the captain doing doing the, the business for us um so ravman Powell really setting himself up to, to to be a part of that team i mean last night on the live we were selecting our teams and um we we were wondering if if uh we would use devon thomas as a bat as a specialist batsman at the top there i don't remember us put calling ravman Powell in there so ravman Powell might be in the mix so it might be it might be um it might be Brandon King is also there. Boy, I tell I tell you, I tell you my viewers and subscribers, this, this one's going to be in, very interesting. So it might be Rastan Chase. Hold on, it might be Shea Hope, um, Shamar Brooks, Rastan Chase, um, Poor and at four. Then we might have Ravman Poel at five, Pollard at six, Hole at seven. It might be something like that, you know. You never you never may tell. See, see the man come and make much runs now. Alright, so let me take a look at the bowling for us. Um, for Ireland, uh, their top scorer, their top scorer, I'm seeing Dockrell. Dockrell actually got 82 of 107 deliveries, so he did well for them. Um, bowling for us, Garden. Garden actually took um, 5 for 34. Yeah, man, so 5 for 34. 
Ravman Powell, Ravman Powell bowl to the bowl also. But what you're not saying? So Ravman Powell um, had a very, very good outing for us. So he made that 82 and then he bowled and got um and got three wickets, three for 32. That's good. Man Singh got um one wicket and McCarthy got one wicket. So that is good, my viewers and subscribers. A very, very good performance by, by the captain. Um getting 80 and then coming back to bowl and, and get um three wickets. So Ravman Poyle really doing the business, my viewers. So we can almost say that Ravman Poyle, you know, he's there or thereabout. Um, don't be surprised if he's selected, especially seeing that Bravo and Lewis, those guys not playing. I might need an extra batsman. I am actually surprised that he bowled and, and, and took some wickets. You know, I, I know this man has a specialist batsman these days, but it's good, it's good. It's very good to see um, Ravman Poyle doing that. You understand? Um, so... At least there, there is there's another option for the for the for the selectors to think about. I don't know if he was carrying any sort of injuries or anything why he wasn't bowling for such a long period of time. So hopefully that is him working himself in. But even if so be the case, um, we wouldn't really want him to be. We wouldn't want to select him as an all rounder. If he's going to bat, if we're going to select him as a batsman, we want to know that he's going to bat. And then we can chip in with the ball. We have too many half and half cricketers already. Odin Smith, Romario, Shepard, um, all of these guys are, are, are basically all rounders doing the same thing. So we want a couple of people to, to, to play a specialist batsman. You know, Lewis not there, Hitmeyer not there. So, you know, we, we need somebody to step up who we, who we think will be able to bat. And that's the thing with, with Ravman Powell. You know, if, he, if he gets off, then he will bat a couple of overs and then he will definitely score and score fast. So if we get an 80 from him in an ODI game, that is good because he's not going to use 150 deliveries to make that, that, that 80. You know, he's not going to use 200 <laughs> balls to make that 80. So, you know, if he's going to make 80, we're looking at it from maybe about 80 something or 90 something balls. So, you know, it's, it's, good, it's good if he's going to come like that for us. So, yeah, that, that, that's pretty good. I actually, I actually didn't know that the game was going on. You know, I didn't know that the game was going on at all. You know, so I, I was actually looking on the West Indies website and I saw where they where they, they post it. So it's it's real good, real good to see that um you know we, we were able to, to play that little warm up game. You understand? Um I mean it's not a, it's it's not like um some of the players that are expected to play for West Indies, you know, were involved. Probably only Ravman Paul, we know Brandon King is there in the in the in what in the old in the T twenty squad. And might get a might 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 get a game, you know. So uh Pollard, Pollard hasn't played any cricket in a while. But you know you know how Pollard is. Is either he comes and, and, and tee off or him not tee off. So I don't know if he really want really want the warm up. Yeah, but it is what it is, you know. Um at least they, they, they got a chance to go out there and, and have a little have a little um warm up especially Ireland because you know when a team come to tour you want to make sure that you give them the opportunity to work themselves in get used to the conditions and thing albeit i am happy that they did not win you understand it's not like it was a very competitive game or anything or any anything that you will be recognized for but at least they got a chance they didn't win and you don't want them going into the into the series um into the game having won anything we don't want that we don't want anything like that I understand. Um, uh, at least they had a player that got a half century, so he will be looking to push on for them. But yeah, my viewers and subscribers, that is basically basically how it went, you know. Um, as I was saying in the video earlier this morning, we are going to be live this evening. So all those who did not get a chance to 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 be on the live last night, we are going to go live this evening at six. I mean, yesterday was very good. I think we were live for over three hours. Yeah man, yeah, yeah, I think maybe close to three and a half hours or somewhere there about we were alive for. So tonight again we are going to go at it. We would have ironed out a good amount of issue last night, but I'm almost certain that persons will want to add things. Plus this little warm-up game that was played, you know, people will probably want to chip in and and, and, and give their opinion in um opinion on what took place. So I will definitely be be going live later on so we can we can um start to spend some time and talk about some stuff zine i think the game will be played on saturday if i'm not mistaken so if we go live this evening um i think that will be a build up towards the game and then tomorrow we can maybe go live again and talk about it zine so let's go and big up on yourself my peeps enjoy the rest of the day and as we go into the weekend just make sure that you all 
um, you know, you keep yourself safe. Big up on yourself.